Hi, this is Zoe from Care Patron. Today I will be guiding you on how to use our semantic differential scale. A semantic differential scale is a valuable psychometric tool used in research and surveys to delve into the quantitative meaning of various concepts or objects. Developed by psychologist Charles E. Osgood and his colleagues in the 1950s, this scale employs a structured set of bipolar adjective pairs representing different dimensions of the concept under investigation. Respondents are tasked with rating the concept or object evaluated on each adjective pair, typically using a numerical scale or a series of checkboxes. The primary purpose of the scale is to capture the intricate nuances of people's attitudes, perceptions or feelings towards a specific subject. Unlike traditional rating scales, focusing on quantitative measurements, the scale delves into the qualitative aspect of individuals' emotional or evaluation associations with the topic. For instance, the context of branding, researchers might use a scale with adjective pairs such as good, bad, innovative, outdated, and trustworthy, untrustworthy to gauge the overall sentiment towards a particular brand. This can provide valuable insights for marketing strategies and brand improvement efforts. To use our free semantic differential scale, follow these steps. Download our semantic differential scale from the Care Patron platform which you can find in the link in the description. Firstly, design the scale. Select relevant adjective pairs that represent the different dimensions of the concept to be measured. Ensure the pairs are opposite to cover the full spectrum of sentiments. Provide instructions. Clearly explain the purpose of the scale and how respondents should complete it. Present adjective pairs. Display the selected adjective pair on the survey or research instrument. Each pair should be separated and clearly labeled. Rating scale. Include a numerical scale or checkboxes for each adjective pair. Rate the concept. Participants rate the concept or object being evaluated for each adjective pair. They mark the scale or select the appropriate checkbox that aligns with their perception. Data collection. Collect responses from the respondents. Ensure that the sample represents the target population adequately. Data analysis. Assign numerical values to the responses and calculate mean scores for each adjective pair. Interpret results. Analyze the data to understand the overall sentiment towards the concept. Applications. Utilize the insights obtained from the semantic differential scale in various fields like marketing, psychology, and social sciences. Here is a sample of our semantic differential scale, which you can find on our Care Patron platform. To find our semantic differential scale, go to our Care Patron platform or click on the link in the description. In our template section, we have a variety of templates and worksheets for you to use with your patients. You can filter or type in the keywords to find the worksheet. Thank you for watching our video at Care Patron. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like. If you would like to see more videos like these, subscribe to our Care Patron channel or click on one of our recommended videos.